Okay, so guys, welcome back to another video. This one's gonna be sniping filters. Some methods I personally use to make coins on the side when the market is quite dead like today. And of course, you can see in the background, I'm close to 1.5 million coins. And these methods have helped me a lot to gain easy coins on the side without investing. And of course, without actually waiting days for my cards to go up in price. Drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and let's get in the video. Okay, so the first filter in the background, quality, gold rare, position forward, league, Premier League, club Arsenal and the nation Brazil, two players, Martinelli and of course, Jesus from Arsenal. Very simple, both 84 rated and both still have some value at this stage of the game, which is very, very early. I would, ex I would have expected them to be a little bit higher, but of course, market crash happened a few days ago. And again, players are slowly coming back down in price. So again, Martinelli, Jesus, you never really know. Martinelli is the more expensive one. He's about 11K and Jesus is about 9,500 coins. Of course, basically a 2,000 coin difference. And of course, you can snipe Jesus. And if Martinelli pops up, the more profit, the better. Very simple filter. And these cards pop on the market literally every 10 to 15 seconds. It's insane. The amount of supply, people opening packs, market matchups, squad battle rewards, etc. You will be getting a lot of snipes. Of course, if you're quicker sniping, this method is for you. Let's talk about a second method. Okay, so boys, let me show you the next method. You need a minimum of 15,000 coins to actually start doing this method. And if you have 100K, 1 million, 2 million, 500K, even better. The more coins you have, the more coins you will be making. The first card has to be Puyo, 170 to 190,000 coins. After tax, it's probably about 12 thousand coins Theo Hernandez 99k to 119 thousand coins Rashford 215 to 250 thousand coins 100 to 120 PSG right winger Diani we have Pirlo 250 to 280 thousand coins again PC in the background once again 114 to 134 160 to 180 and the list goes on and on and on this is basically my premium trading discord anyone can join Every single budget is welcome as long as you have at least five to 10,000 coins. Of course, then you can do the low budget advice I do suggest. And then of course, 10, 15, 20, 50, 100K is very, very easy to get coins from there. And of course, like I said, boys, and I keep saying 10 pound a month in my Discord versus 10 pound in FIFA points. Again, 10 pound worth of FIFA points, you're probably gonna get 10 to 15K back. 10 pound a month in my Discord, you get me, three other traders giving you advice every single day what to buy, what to sell, which players we should be investing into as a Discord together, and of course, the flips, icon flips, and we tell you exactly when to sell the cards. It's very, very simple. PC is also covered. And of course, like I have been saying, it's very, very simple to use. You join the Discord, you put notifications on for the flips, investments, low budget, high budget, medium budget, and you will get a notification when to buy a player, and we tell you exactly when to sell the exact player. I trade in the Discord with three other traders. Boys, link will be down in the comments. Of course, let's get back to the video. Okay, so guys, the second sniping filter, again, one of my favorites so far because there's three different players to be sniping with this exact filter. Quality, gold, rare, nation, England, position, right wing. I think you have Saka, Kelly, and Mead. Three different players. Of course, Saka is more expensive if he pops up. And if you snipe him, that's like 30,000 coins profit. Of course, three players, two females and Saka. Very, very effective. Like I said, females pop up so much cheaper than actual price. Because of course, like I said, people don't check the price of low rated cards. They just list them up for what Fubin says. And if there's a Fubin mistake, that means he's going to list or she's going to list the card on the market for much cheaper than the actual price of Mead, Kelly or Saka. And that means you can snipe make profit and sell that card instantly. Very, very nice, simple sniping filter. Gold rare, right wing, England. Very nice. Let's talk about the next filter. Okay, so guys, moving on to the third filter. Of course, if you do want more filters every single video from now on, all you have to do, subscribe. It takes two seconds and drop a like. And of course, you do support me by dropping a like and subscribing. Again, I'm not asking for much, just a quick sub and a quick like. Quality, gold rare. Position, any, league, Premier League, Club, Man City, and of course the nation has to be England. You're gonna have two players, Stones and Grealish, both 85 rated. Very simple, go to the market whenever you see this video, see what the cheapest player from this filter is, and snipe 400 to 500 coins under again. Stones and Grealish pop up a lot. They're very, very packable. Personally, I think that pack Grealish like 
four times already so of course this filter is very good if cards are easy to pack that means a lot of cards will be popping up and that means you have a higher chance of actually sniping them if more cards do pop up of course guys let's talk about a final sniping filter of course like i said content today was quite dead i suggested a few things to do in my discord once content is dead one of them was fodder and one of them was a low budget trading methods as you saw in the background someone went from 25k to about 450k in three days using a low budget medium budget and then moving on to icons and heroes like i said link will be down in the comments join up and of course let's talk about the final filter okay so guys the final filter in the background quality gold rare position right wing nationality brazil we have three different players we have fidget spinner from manu we have rafinha from barcelona and we have felipe anderson from the italian league of course Fidget Spinner being the cheapest card, I think that's Anderson, the next cheapest, and of course, Rafinha being the most expensive. I like this one because, of course, Felipe Anderson and actually Anthony, they pop up a lot because of the ratings. They are so low, people list them for 700 coins when they're about 1,100 coins. And of course, that equals 400 coins each snipe, 10 snipes, 4k profit, 100 snipes, 40,000 coins profit. Like I said, guys, if you want more filters, all you have to do drop a like it takes two seconds and of course the more likes this video gets the more again i can see people want more filters in more videos in the upcoming days and of course investments will be back tomorrow if content is finally good from ea sports of course guys like i said premium discord down below if you're interested again if you spend the money on fever points give this a go spend 10 pound a month in my discord if you're not happy you can cancel at any time versus 10 pound on fever points i'm trying to save your guys's money of course i hate when people buy fever points i cannot stand it you're basically giving ea money to get nothing in return it's basically a gamble so of course join my discord look at the investments look at the flips look at the stuff we suggest as traders and of course you saw examples people starting with low budget 10 15k and of course in a few days easy 200 to 300 000 coins using the icons hero cards fodder investments and flips like i said boys link will be down in the comments drop a like subscribe if you're new and of course i'll see you boys tomorrow for a new video